Hey guys, how you doing? This is Sasha Chapman once again with Chapman Realty Group on my real estate drive, waiting for my next client here. And I'm just gonna shoot a couple series of videos. Now, here's the question I keep getting asked. Sasha, the market is getting worse with the interest rates. Yes, it is. All right, I'm gonna tell you that right now. Um, we have been spoiled, if you will, you know what I'm saying? I bought my first home at 3.5%, I believe. And so the 3.5 and the 4% days, I'm sorry guys, they're going away. Unless you're buying down the points. And that's a lot of money you gotta use to buy down. Okay, still getting down to 4% is gonna be very tough. So where are we right now here in DFW? So on average, we're seeing rates really starting to hit the fives consistently, like 5%. I've seen a 4.8, I've seen 4.9, but we're at 5%. So what a lot of people are going to tell me is, well, Sasha, that's just too much to fall by a house. And I'm going to tell you what's real. So here's what's real. Buying a house at 5% may sound bad, but buying it at 5.2 or 5.5 or 6% is worse because that's where we're headed. If you ask any good loan officer, they will tell you that the interest rates are rising. And within two years, guys, we could be looking at 7% interest rates. And I guarantee you this, if you need a house, you are going to buy that house at 7%. A lot of people saying they're waiting for the market to crash here in DFW. We're different, okay? I'm gonna be very honest with you in my opinion on that one. We are different from other uh, markets because we have a more stable economy, right? And what I mean by that is we have jobs coming here. So let me explain that. We have jobs coming here, okay? They may not be the highest of wage jobs, but the DFW is one of the top three cities in America for job growth. So as jobs come here and they invest in that way, our economy stays great. But unfortunately, interest rates are based off of national trends as well, not just the state and what's going on in your local area. Um, so when the Fed goes up on the interest rates, guess what happens? And the interest rates do jump up, and that did just happen. And the Fed's talking about going up again here in December. So what does that mean for you? It means that if you can afford to buy a house and you are pre-approved or pre-qualified to buy a house, you need to do so now because what you don't want is to buy a house at a 5.5 rate when you can get that house at 5%. And that is what's happening. The good news is home prices are starting to plateau a little bit. They're not gonna drop. Okay, that's not about to happen. They're not just about to just fall, fall dramatically. But we've been on a, on a trend like this for a minute and they're just starting to level out, okay? So that, that's a good thing. That means you can get the house a little bit cheaper and you need to try to take advantage of getting it at a lower interest rate right, right now. now Let's say you're, you need a little bit more help. There are lots of programs out there that can help you for down payment assistance. We have that here in Texas in a lot of different ways that money can be used towards closing costs and other um, closing costs and down payment assistance. Great programs out there, okay? Um, I'll make a video about that. It's gonna be a little bit longer than two or three minutes because I really have to explain those programs in their entirety. But this is Sasha Chapman here of Chapman Realty Group, Fort Worth's best realtor, all right? If you need a home or your friend needs a house or whatever, you just want to start talking about home ownership, give me a call, 817-668-0311. Make sure you guys like and subscribe and leave your comments down below, and I'll be more than happy to address all the comments. So if there's a particular video that you do want, let me know, and I'll do that as well. All right, um, I really do have to go here, so I'm going to talk to you guys later. I got to sit down with my next client and help, help them get to home ownership. I can do the same for you. All right, take care. Bye.